Hello, all my nerd friends out there. This is Miss Chillier, and I want to give you guys my wish list for DC Multiverse for the year 2023. I uh, hopefully a lot of these characters come out because I know this is probably on every other's wish list as well. There's a lot of characters McFarlane needs to catch up on, so definitely Dark Side. I'm surprised we haven't got a good comic book version Dark Side that McFarlane haven't made. He loves making these kind of big monster villains, and Dark Side would be dope. It'd be dope. Imagine putting like a throne um, set with a Dark Side to sit in um, with laser beam effects. Just look at Timony. He should go all out Dark Side. They'll be dope to have on the shelf. Definitely Doomsday as well. Why we haven't got a Doomsday? Right? We got Devastator. It looks like Doomsday. But Doomsday, I know McFarlane is playing something big. I know he would do a great job. He loves doing monster characters like this. He did a pretty good Devastator. But imagine doing a two-pack with a new Superman and Doomsday. That will be dope. Oh, be dope. Like, kind of like a Death of Superman two-pack. would be dope. I would love that. Hopefully McFarlane does that this year. Um, and let's get... Um, Brainiac, be dope, cool, yeah, cool Brainiac, maybe some Brainiac bots that he has controlling robots, hope he does a cool Brainiac, you know, he does great designs, we haven't got no Brainiac, we need to get some of these big Justice League villains out there, hopefully McFarlane gives us some more great villains out there, and stop doing so many Batmans out there, but uh, Brainiac would be really cool to have on the shelf, and Hardy Quinn, that's another character I'm shocked, because she is so popular, I'm surprised we have got every version of Hardy Quinn out there. I know I would love that new 52 Hardy Quinn. That's one of my favorite designs. But I would like more Hardy Quinn figures, comic book versions out there. You know, we got a couple of movie versions. And I think like one or two, maybe one comic book version, one um, anime version. But it would be cool to get more Hardy Quinn out there. Who doesn't want more Hardy Quinn? Now, Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman is in everyone's wish list. I know that. Classic Wonder Woman. Her classic red and blue uh, alpha gold armor. That'd be dope with that robe. And hopefully a cloth cape. Like, I wish McFarlane gives more cloth cape. You know, it's no harm in that. Um, just, we need a good Wonder Woman. We got some other visions of it, but Wonder Woman is a must-have. Now, let's start by building that Team Titans, you know. We need Starfire. I heard Cyborg's coming out. They're making a build figure of him. So, let's get Starfire. One of my favorite female Team Titans. There's many versions of her. Hopefully they do a great job on her. So uh, that's what McFarlane needs to do. Start doing more female characters. He has not many. If you look at the list, um, Starfire is a must-have in my book. One of my favorite females. Another Teen Titan member, Raven. Do a cool Raven, long cape, um, power purple power effects. Kind of like the one they gave us for um, Constantine. That spell effect would be cool to do that with Raven, but purple. Just would be dope to get that. You know, Raven to add to the list. The Teen Titans. We got Nightwing. We need to get Beast Boy, Cyborg coming. And we get Starfire. To start building that Teen Titans. Come on, McFarlane. Now, Supergirl. I'm surprised Supergirl haven't got made. We got Superboy coming in. We got John Kent already. We got Superman. We need Supergirl now. Let's get Supergirl in here. Supergirl. Let's get build that Superman uh, family. Supergirl is a must have. Hopefully, she comes out 2023. And hopefully, McFarlane does a great job. On our female characters. Now, Cheetah. Let's get some villains for Wonder Woman now. Cheetah's a must have. I got the DC Direct um, Cheetah. That was really good. But hopefully, McFarlane gets a 7 inch going because we need someone to match with Wonder Woman, obviously. So, hopefully, Cheetah's in the list too. I, I know you do a good trade. There's great jobs on like creature, creature, uh, creature characters. Cheetah, I think you'll do a good job on it. Now, let's get Garganta. Uh, Garganta, yeah, hopefully I said her name right, but her, we, I mean, we got the Adam Slasher, big old tall character, be cool to get a big old tall female character, female feeling like her, smash, make it 14 inches, uh, he he makes big things pretty good price, so it won't be that expensive, no, probably like 50, 60 bucks, maybe 70, I'll pay for that if she's a perfect size, um, then Sinistro, the Sinistro Corpse, the Yellow Lantern Corpse, Definitely a must have. We got some, we're getting a lot of green lanterns coming in there and there. Now let's start building that yellow lanterns. We got red lanterns, black lanterns, green lanterns, but no yellow lanterns. Let's get the yellow corpse going, though. Fear needs to come. So hopefully McFarlane start giving us some cool yellow lanterns. Definitely with Sinistro. I'll build that Legion of Doom because he needs him. And maybe that purple one. I forgot what I call it. The violet one that he wears too. The Sinistro Rose wears. Be cool to get that character as well. That outfit. And now let's get Gorilla Grud without his uh, armor 
or because we got a couple gorilla grunts with that go down with the ingested version in that weird version that he came up with the futuristic whatever but give us gorilla grud in his king outfit the comic book version maybe we know armor was cool uh swap heads get a normal head and a screaming head open hands fisting hands to help fight the flash be dope get gorilla grud like that now let's get punchline the newest character and i would love a punchline figure like i said she's another popular female character like harley quinn it would be cool to do that character i would love mcfarland to do punchline come on mcfarland give me punchline here i would love to have that character on my shelf match with the joker the new joker's girlfriend or face off against harley quinn two-pack that'd be dope but comment below Give me your wish list for the year 2023 that you want McFarlane to work on. You want DC Multiverse to have. What's your wish list for 2023? It's fun to make these. I'm having fun making these wish lists. Hopefully one of them comes true or all of them come true. That'd be dope. It'd be good for all of us to have. But thank you all for watching. Please hit the like button if you enjoyed my video. And please subscribe to my channel if you're new and to get all my DC Multiverse reviews. And I'll talk to y'all next time. Have a good holidays and have a good day and good night. And remember, stay nerdy forever. Bye.